So sometimes it can be a little daunting if you aren't really into digital media or computers or phones, you might feel like that's just for someone else. But I want to tell you a little story about my grandma. She was, after my grandfather passed away and he was 97, there was a computer there that my grandpa used but she never really touched. But she thought, it's there, I might as well learn. And so at 96 years of age, my grandma learned how to email. And to this day, she's 101, and she still emails. So it's never too late to learn. Just have a growth mindset, be willing to ask questions, maybe get someone else to teach you or go on YouTube. There's no end to what you can learn, no matter what your age. And she has a Facebook account as well. Yeah, so yeah. you can never be too old. Think that you can do something. Um, I want to share with you as well the project that we've been working on for about the past year, a project called Lineage. Um, it came up as an idea from a friend of mine, a young person. He approached me and said, I've got this idea to film some videos. And we had never done anything like that before. He had never done anything like that before. And we just started working together on this idea. And we started planning to film in England, in London, Oxford and Cambridge and Lutterworth and places like that, a series of um, videos on the Reformation. And what happened over the course of time was that as we didn't really realize how big the idea was or how much it would take, we just kind of started on it. But the Lord provided different people to the team. And so I want to encourage you that if you've got an idea of something to do, to, 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 to reach out and start with it. And as you go along this journey, the Lord may provide people um, to come and help you. We've got different people on our team. Some of them are the ones who film. Some of them are the ones who just take the photos. Some of the ones, literally their job is just to kind of repost on social media and post on social media. Each person has a key role on the team. And, and the team kind of grew organically as, as it formed. And so there's a difference in our team. Some of us are the ones who kind of write the content. Some of us are the ones who produce it. Some of our the, are the ones who kind of uh, you know, critique or analyze it before it's produced. Some of, some of us are the ones who just repost. And you know, there, 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 there's different roles in media ministry. Some of it you may think, well, I can't make a video. But maybe you could have a church Facebook page and all you may actually do is repost videos that other people share and that way you're still providing content to the people that are there on your page and you're still ministering to them in that way. You know, there is great opportunity, I believe, in media, especially the, the current generation or the younger generation, those who people, who, excuse me, those who people term as millennials or even the younger generation, the teenagers, they have been born in a world where they are immersed in digital technology. They have grown up always knowing what a smartphone is. They don't know a world without smartphones. They don't know a world without these type of digital technologies. And so it's just part of their life. And so in order to reach this generation, we have to become somewhat con conversant in this technology because that's often where they are. And so as a local church, as a youth group, or whatever um, sphere of ministry you may be in, it's important to utilize these technologies in order to reach people where they are. So I just want to encourage you that wherever you are and whatever ministry you have, to or take however it, old you are. Or however old you are, to take advantage of whatever technology is there and use it. And there's something um, I think that the, the younger generation appreciate when you kind of are intentionally trying to use a platform or a medium that they communicate on regularly and they appreciate you kind of reaching out to them in that way. So may God bless you and I pray that he um, guides you and gives you creative ideas as to what you can do in your ministry.